without the sleds, there is finally enough snow in most parts of the state to get out and hit the trails. So a lot of people, this is actually the first weekend they're getting out and exploring on their snowmobiles. These riders in Loudoun taking advantage of the fresh blanket of snow on the ground. That's pretty good. It's fun because it was all powder. Groomers were spotted in the Stewartstown Dixville Notch area as people took in the sights there, as well as in Jaffrey, after what so far has been a slow start to the season. It's not the greatest because we didn't get much snow, but... I like how we got a lot of snow now. Oh yeah, we were we were excited. Yeah, <laughs> he, he was looking out the window, waiting. Wanted, uh, first thing this morning, we wanted to know how much we got, so we get out there and ride. With it being a long weekend, there are a lot of extra people out on the trails. Conservation officers are urging people to take extra precautions. When you're heading out on the trails, the biggest thing is is riding within your capabilities. Fish and game responding to multiple crashes, mostly up north. Most of them had to deal with an experience. A couple of them had to deal with speed. We had one person to succumb to injuries sustained in an accident um, in the primary causation of that accident with speed. Conservation officers want to remind people that the maximum speed on the trails is 45 miles per hour. Less experienced riders should take it even slower to be safe. In Concord, Siobhan Lopez, WMUR News 9.